keeping up with Sussex's Kardashian Ray's eyebrow over Meghan's creepy plot to copy their show. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will be taking part in an at home with the Duke and Duchess of Sussex style docuseries as Netflix seeks to get its pound of flesh from the couple, a source has claimed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex signed a $100 million, £72 million, contract with the streaming giant in 2020 after moving to the US, with a documentary titled Heart of Invictus focusing on competitors at the Invictus Games expected to be released later this year. Page Six, opening its piece with its keeping up with the Sussexes, quotes a producer source as saying that with regards to a docuseries about Meghan and Harry, the timing is still being discussed, things are up in the air. The outlet claims Netflix bosses would like to air the show at the same time as the release of Prince Harry's highly anticipated memoir, while the Sussexes are reportedly keen for the project to air next year instead. The couple were shadowed by cameras during their trip to The Hague for the Invictus Games last month but the cameras have been reportedly allowed behind the scenes at their home in Montecito and joined the Sussexes on their New York trip last September. It's not yet known what will be included in the documentary, but a source said, I think it's fair to say that Netflix is getting its pound of flesh. Leilani Dowding once spoke out about the Duchess saying that Meghan Markle wants to be a Kardashian. Sources close to Meghan Markle are claiming that she wants to be like a Kardashian from keeping up with the Kardashians. The Duchess has had a hard time making a good impression after marrying the prince of her dreams and then recently aiding in the decision to remove herself and her family from the British monarchy. According to model Leilani Dowding, she thinks that Markle wants to build an empire close to what Kim Kardashian achieved. The former The Real Housewives of Cheshire star spoke to Express to reveal that she fully believes Markle had every intention of leaving the royal family behind and dragging her blindsided prince with her. Dowding told Express that she called the move to Los Angeles ages ago, saying, she didn't want to go to like the biscuit factories or, you know, go to Cleethorpes, referring to the royal duties that were expected of a duchess. According to the model, Markle expected to be speaking her mind a lot more and was not ready to have to be a listener to the people. Dowding bluntly explained that Markle's one job was to listen and not to be spouting your mouth off and having an opinion. The English housewife felt that Markle had no idea what was in store for her and probably hoped she was going to be like one of the Keeping Up with the Kardashians stars. There has been no love lost amongst the British people as many felt Markle turned her nose up at traditions. The same can be said about Americans who tend to side with the British as they often give Meghan the cold shoulder. But one thing is for sure, Markle will not be the fourth Kardashian, and really why would she want to be? Piers Morgan also blasted Harry and Meghan as the royal Kardashians after Harry's advert in New Zealand. He said, the hypocrisy in everything Prince Harry and his wife Meghan Markle does is never better illustrated than with his latest preaching about sustainable eco-travel in an eye-rolling commercial for his non-profit organization Travelist. Sadly, the laughter was once again at him, not with him. Wearing a Girl Dad t-shirt, Harry is seen jogging through the woods before he's stopped by eco-tourist rating agents and berated about a lollipop wrapper he supposedly dropped there during a 2018 royal tour trip with wife Meghan, but praised for turning off running tap water while he brushes his teeth. That revelation prompted a bewildered Harry to exclaim, How do you know that? That's really weird. Because, of course. He's such a private guy and that's secret personal information that could only be known if he turned into a Kardashian with 24-7 cameras recording his every ablution and tooth cleansing.